quit your job. Your, your colleagues might not understand it, but at least you know you're being true to your conscience. And you're setting a good example for your family and your kids. You're not going to subsist off of stolen money. You're not going to subsist off of shaking people down and caging peaceful people. I go to bed every night knowing that I'm helping people in countless ways. Do you do the same? It's a matter, Saj. You don't remember your oath? You're ashamed to wear chevrons on your shoulder, man. Should be arrested and tried for treason, a violation of the Fourth Amendment. Following an illegal order. Hey, you guys may not have seen it, but earlier this year, we put out a video. It said 500 federal reserve notes or 500 Bitcoin, the first police employee that does a felony arrest with a colleague. So that's still up for grabs. I know that no one will probably won't pay the bills as much as your uh, money stolen from the community members, but at least uh, you know it'll be. It would be something that's earned and deserved. deserved. So uh, if you're ever in those kind of situations, I encourage you to act on it. No matter how way you stand, Saad, you're still uh, violating the Fourth Amendment. And if you do believe that you're serving people, Kim, that's, that's racial profiling right there. Because you got a mass plate too, huh? If you consider yourself to be a good cop and you um, look the other way when your colleague way. does something you know is wrong, you are just as bad as they are. You are allowing that to persist. And if you tell yourself you step in in a future more egregious situation, that's a lie because if you refuse to step up for something smaller, you set the stage for larger rights violations. And that's why we, how we got to where we see today. These Checkpoints being funded from a criminal gang in D.C. All over the states, these MRAPs and Veritas being distributed, and all the other BS that's going on. I solemnly swear. <laughs> Excuse me. You guys act as individuals. You're not a monolith. I would hope someone wants to be. Oh, these guys are program. These guys are program robots. They don't think they're accountable to anybody but themselves. They don't realize that we have more power than that sergeant right there. You guys never read the Eighth Amendment of the New Hampshire State Constitution, have you? Always be responsive to the public. Always be accountable to the public. But no, you don't want to be responsive because you're cowards. Consider this for a moment. Your detective told me cowards are the ones that stay silent. That comes from your officer. Cow and stay silent. For a moment. Not all slavery is physical. Slavery begins in the mind. Freedom begins in the mind. You guys are living in your own mental prison by choice. And to see the walls is to leave it. They're, they're making traffic stops ahead, too. Where? Trying up ahead. That's what Dog Fort just said. Because we keep stopping people from going in here, so they want to pull them over before they get a chance to turn around. Oh, so they're further down now. Okay. No, in their regular car, they've just been yanking people, pulling people over. Like Mr. Secret Police over there that likes to ignore people while his window's down. Oh, I can't hear you. You guys don't have to answer any questions they have. You don't have to answer nothing. Ignore them. Ignore them. You're not required to show him nothing.
You guys are just coming back from eating. Why don't you just let them go? Let them finish their dinner. These checkpoints are illegal. You do not have to answer their questions. I solemnly swear. <laughs> yeah, how'd that feel being inconvenienced by them? I always love to be inconvenienced when I'm eating. He's just showing him his bike. There goes your illegal secret police. Look at that. Illegal Yui right there without his emergency lights on. No directional, nothing. You guys leaving, Sergeant? You guys have the judge's order on site? Do you guys have the petition with you? Well, spending my gas money by running this car all night. I really love paying for that gas. Good work tonight. Nothing like stealing people's money to shake other people down and stop them from traveling freely. Do you guys have the judge's petition on you? On site? Do you love yourself? Man, you secretly hate yourself. These Are guys you... don't like to be responsive at all. Are you a self loathing individual? <laughs> do you, you not like who you are? Do you even know what the Eighth Amendment of the New Hampshire State Constitution says? It says you have to answer my question, sir. You have to. Do you like who you are? Or do you secretly hate yourself but you don't want to admit it? Do you guys get permission to do this on private property? Does he let you? Man, you guys don't like answering anybody's questions. Served this country 20, 20 years I served this country, man. You guys are sad. You could thank me by remembering your oath. Hey, Sarge, do you guys got the petition on you? You got the judge's petition on you? Sergeant, can you multitask? Do you have the judge's uh, petition on you? State statute says you have to have it on site. And your safety plan as well. You don't have it on you. Everything. Can I see it? No. Why not? Who are you? I'm a member of the public. That's who I am. 